beauties never seen before 1990 photos of kisses gene simmons in erie pa christine's chronicles posted on july 6 2024 by x teen the writer the infamous rock group kiss stormed into the sleepy city of erie pa on october 16 1990 amid censorship controversy on the local level the hubbub was regarding Kiss's stop in Erie during the group's steamy Hot in the Shade tour. It was under these circumstances that my interview with Gene Simmons took place downtown at the Erie Civic Center. There was only myself and one other reporter in attendance who was also female. When Simmons first entered the room and saw that we had set up three chairs in a triangle to talk with him, he grabbed a stack of about seven extra chairs and placed it upon the single chair that we had selected for him. He then sat on top of the pile of chairs and extended his legs outward so that one foot was on my chair and the other was on my colleague's chair. At this point, I knew it was going to be an eye-opening experience talking to this notorious legend, and it was. We asked Simmons about the local outcry to censor and or stop the show from going on. His reply was as brilliant as his foot-to-chair setup. I don't recall his exact verbiage, but he brought up the Bible and mentioned that in this holy book, quote, everybody begat everybody else, unquote. So he wasn't sure what all the fuss was about. Until last year, the whereabouts of the original negatives from pictures taken during this interview were unknown. Luckily, they were discovered recently and the images below were produced from those negatives. Except for one, none of these semi-candid images were ever seen by anybody but me and the guy in the darkroom in 1990. One of them was published in a small weekly newspaper called The Mill Creek Sun. Here's my personal VIP pass to be backstage and talk with Mr. Simmons for the newspaper. You can see the hot in the shade 1990 mark here. Here is Kiss's set list from their performance at the Erie Civic Center in Erie, Pennsylvania, hot in the shade. If you look at the set list, you go down and you see all these great songs, but they didn't play their big hit, Rock and Roll All Night, until the second encore. So those fans must have had a lot of energy to beg for two songs so that they could hear what they really wanted to hear. Here is Mr. Simmons with a little bit of a smile on his face. He was quite charming, and he had a powerful presence just entering the room. Here he is with a little uh, look to the side deep in thought and this is my personal favorite the straight on look here's the last picture we took that day and I Christine Lorraine Morgan would like to thank you for listening and watching about Gene Simmons when he was in Erie Pennsylvania in 1990 Thanks Please so much. Visit the website xteenthewriter.com. Thank you so much. Take care. Bye bye.